today I'm going to be decorating yet another vignette. This one is in my kitchen as well, kind of behind my uh, couch in the family room. Uh, if I'm entertaining and we're inside, this is where I would put my drinks and maybe some cups and ice and all that stuff. So I like to have a portable decor piece that I can just pick up and move that's not requiring me to move ton of stuff off. As you can see, I removed everything off. It needs to get cleaned, dusted, and then I'm going to start adding stuff on. And let me share some of the stuff that I have that I'm planning on using. So I have it all set up over here on the table. So these flowers, I am loving them so, so much. I use them in springtime on this tray and I think I'm going to use them again. I got these at Dalarama and I thought that was such an amazing score because they do, I mean, if you look at them, you see that they're kind of plasticky and stuff, but uh -huh. they look expensive. Like if you just look at the petals and the leaves and stuff, and like I said, I love them. And then I'm using my vase that I typically use. And then here are some of the things. So I usually use this lantern, but I kind of want to take it outside. So I have brought up my new one that I just DIY'd. It has that coastal look, as well as that sign is brand new. And then I have a couple fillers, obviously lemons, because that is something that I'm decorating my whole house with for the summer. So I would like to tie it in into this tray as well. So I'm going to get started, but first I'm gonna clean it and then take you along with me as I'm decorating it. So I am just giving this a good clean or using a microfiber cloth and, uh, and some water. I also would like to mention that this video is part of a challenge that is hosted by Denise Jordan and she had asked us to create a vignette in our kitchen that ties in our kitchen decor as well as includes a sign with some words on it and uh, some type of greenery whether it's a uh, live or fake it doesn't matter so there make sure you check out denise's channel which will be linked in the description box as well as the playlist which i will link once you are finished watching my video i'm sure you're gonna get tons of different ideas for your kitchen vignettes i enjoy um decorating on trays in um in my especially in my kitchen because it is one place where I like to move things around and uh, it, what there's not an easier way to move things out of the way if they're on a tray that way you're not constantly decorating redecorating your space because you're constantly moving and this way you just pick up the tray and off you go so I have started adding a couple things to it. Um, I am yes, uh, I am using this water, watering can that I had DIY a couple years back over on my DIY channel. And you can check out, I will link my summer DIY playlist um, in the description box as well. So you can check out all the different DIYs that I'm using here as well as other ones that I created for my uh, home decor. I'm using quite a bit of them this year and I am liking how um, inexpensive it has been for me to redecorate my spaces for this for this summer season. Not sure if that's how it's going to be for fall as well, but I'm definitely planning on using a ton of my own DIYs. If I'm creating them, might as well use them. So my theme um, throughout the house, if you've been kind of following along, you know it's um, it's a lemon. But if you have not been following along, make sure you... Um, Press the subscribe button. I would love it if you join my YouTube family. And that way you um, can follow along as well. And uh, make sure that notification bell is on so you don't miss out any of my uploads. I do tons of decorating as well as cleaning and organizing on this channel. So as you can see, I had added my flowers and now I am trying to figure out what to do for the bottom here, what to use. I was planning on using a candle, but didn't really love it. Then I added the clear crystal uh, candle holder, didn't love 
that a, a whole lot. I did end up getting some of my succulents to add because I find that their green, greens on them are a little bit brighter and maybe a different tone of green and I thought this would look good because I do love including lots of greenery with my lemons um, as well. So that is what I'm trying to figure out here what works and what doesn't. So here it is all finished i have to say i'm not 100 percent sure here so i might change it before my home tour but we'll see i don't know i like it but i'm not sure whether i love it so but i do love the sign the greenery still loving the flowers i think they look spectacular and the uh, lantern ties right in so I would like to thank the hostess for hosting this challenge. Make sure to check out the playlist after you're done watching my video. And if you're not subscribed, I would love it if you press that subscribe button and a notification bell so you don't miss out any of my future uploads, especially my home tour, which I'm super excited to share with you soon. So until next time, hope you guys have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching.